Welcome to this two minute tutorial for biggerplate.com. In this tutorial, we're going to show you how to add map markers to your XY maps, which will help to visually distinguish different sections of your map and provide instant visual cues related to the content. So let's get started. Here we can see a basic XMind map, which outlines the strengths, weaknesses, opportunities, and threats for a fictional business. To help us get started with markers, we're going to add a relevant marker to each of our main headings. First, we'll select our strengths topic by clicking on it. Now, we'll open the markers tab, which can be found here. You'll see a selection of markers shown here, and to add any marker to your topic, simply click it once as shown. Now, let's move to our weaknesses topic. You'll notice that the markers panel has automatically closed itself as we click the new topic. We can reopen the panel using the same button as before, or we can click the Restore button here, which will keep the markers panel open until we choose to close it, regardless of where we click on the map. If at any point you want to hide the markers panel, you can just click here to minimize the tab. If we open up the markers tab once again, we can add a marker to our final two headings as shown. If at any point you add the wrong marker, or perhaps add one marker too many, you can delete them by right-clicking on the marker and selecting Delete. You'll notice that right-clicking on a marker also gives you the option to replace the selected marker with an alternative, which you do simply by clicking your new choice. Markers in XMind can also help to highlight certain topics within the map for particular attention. For example, within this map, we might want to highlight certain topics that require urgent action. We can do this by selecting multiple topics using the control key on our keyboard and clicking the topics we want to mark. We can then select a marker and add it to all the selected topics at once. Our map now contains a simple visual signal showing where the most urgent action is required. With the pro version of XMind, you can use these markers to filter your mind map content as shown. For more information about mind map filters, please see the relevant tutorial on biggerplate.com. That's it for this tutorial, but don't forget, you can view more XMind tutorials, templates and examples by visiting biggerplate.com.